morning, Clay Chapel. This is a bundle of grapes. And Elastigirl with CCN TV. Today is Thursday, November 1st, and here are your announcements for the day. Seniors, if you, are, if you have purchased a page in the yearbook, forms and money are due tomorrow, November the 2nd. Late forms will not be accepted. Ad contracts and money are due Friday. Boys soccer team trials will be next Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday from 3.15 to 5 o'clock. You may sign up outside Coach Adams' door and see him if you have any questions. A recruiter from the University of South Alabama will be outside of the cafeteria on November the 6th. Stop by and check them out if you are interested in attending BSC. As we start a new month, let's take a look back at our October Students of the Month. Today, we featured the Junior Student of the Month, for October, Bailey Porter. Student of the Month at Clay Chapman will always be an honor and a privilege. The student bestowed with the honor of this month is Miss Bailey Porter. Bailey likes to do many activities outside of school. I actually really like to go to work. I work at 24E in Trustville and um, I work in the daycare. And I really like talking to the kids because a lot of them are older. And so I really like talking to them and getting to know them and just having fun with them because a lot of times that's, that's a place that they go just to have fun and let go. I think it's really cool talking to them and getting to know them and um, inspiring some of them because I feel like I have an influence on some of them. Just being a leader, um, just being somebody that people can look up to around the school and be like, just have you as a goal. People can look up to you because you're in many organizations you're involved in a lot of stuff and they just look at you and, and you're a motivator for them. You're what they hope that they can accomplish. So I just feel like I'm involved in the school so much and I have a desire to be involved in the school because of what the school's done for me. It's just done a lot of good to me. Um, I'm in all of these classes and all my teachers. I love them all. They've all helped me to accomplish the goals that I've accomplished academically and um, a lot of my teachers really care about me and I love our administrators so just looking at my future. Some people may say I look at it a little too much but I'm always looking ahead seeing why would I do this if it doesn't benefit me in the long run so I just that's how I stay inspired that's how I stay motivated because if I don't do this then you know my future is not going to have the outcome that I want it to have so I'm just saying think big picture and, and do everything like it counts. Here at CCHS, teachers inspire her. It's, it's a tie between Miss Creighton and Mr. Hickman. Um, I love Mr. Hickman because he's just so wholesome and he cares so much about our students. And, and another thing is, is he's just so passionate about his job. And I think it's so cool because if you're going to be in a profession, you need to be in a profession that you really care about and that's really important to you. And I know Mr. Hickman, he, he loves what he does and it's so inspiring to see you know, how, how much he loves his job and how much he loves coming here every day, and he's such a good man. And Miss Creighton is our new counselor, and she's just awesome. She cares so much about us, she is so sweet, and um, personally, she's helped me a lot spiritually. Um, on my journey with God, she's, she's just so sweet, and she's so wholesome, and she, she cares a lot about the students here. Morning CCHS, I'm Brian Spivey with CCN TV and welcome back to your weekly sports recap. The varsity football team played at home this week against a 1-8 Huffman squad. Right. Senior quarterback Willie Miller had a 17-yard touchdown pass to senior tight end Anthony Lohe. Also had a 10-yard touchdown run. Defensive end Jaden Johnson had an interception which was the Cougars second of the game. The Cougars finished the game with 314 total yards and a 49-14 final. Tonight, the Cougars will be at home versus Gaston City. Come out and support your Cougars. Also, last Thursday, our Lady Cougar volleyball team traveled to Huntsville and, and competed at regionals. After beating Shades Valley, they advanced to Sweet 16 to play Hazel Green. Sadly, the Cougars fell short to Hazel Green and in their season. We want to congratulate our Lady Cougars for their successful season. Great job, ladies. This has been Bryant Spivey with CCN TV and your weekly sports recap. This is Laura, and today's lunch will be chicken poppers, homemade roll, bean and beef burrito, mashed potatoes, green beans, carrots, fruit, and milk.
Hey, I'm Tamia, and tomorrow's breakfast will be cinnamon roll with icing, oatmeal, cereal, fruit, and juice to wash it down. Thanks for watching. Have a great day, CCHS.